I remember when I first discovered the Eagles, I was, I think I was 13 years old, maybe a year after their debut album in 1972. And remember, it was an era, and, and if you watch this channel, you're probably from that era of picking up an LP and writing and, and reading the, the liner notes and trying to figure out where they came from and who they are because they're just jiving with us so well. That debut album featured the first of five Jack Tempson songs that he either wrote or co-wrote for the band. I remember first having their second album, Desperado, in my hand, which, by the way, was released a year after the debut. And then the third, On the Border, which featured the second song, written by Jack Temchin, this time a co-write. I'm not familiar with Rob Strandlin with Already Gone. Yeah, he and I wrote that. He was just a guy I knew here in San Diego who played really well, and we did a gig together and all that. Then he later went to Nashville. I believe he wrote a couple hit songs, and he was in Nashville for, for quite some time and did really well. And then he, he quit music and came back to Northern California, became an architect and uh, designed like buildings all over the world and stuff. So I think he's retired now, but he, he still plays. I was checking out a lot of Jack Temchin's more current songs. I asked him about one of those. Jesus and Mohammed with uh, Rusty Young. Love that song, got to tell you. That was, uh, I wrote it up to my friend Bill Franklin. He, he just kind of said, well, what if Jesus and Mohammed, you know, and they're up in heaven or whatever, and they're sitting around, what, do they th- what would they think? And uh, it's a challenging song because... To be honest, Jesus, a lot of Jesus people don't want Mohammed in their song, and a lot of Mohammed people don't want Jesus in their song, you know, which is really just exactly what the song's about. So I just thought I had something to say, just wanted to say it, and I was so happy that Blue Alon put that, for, I recorded a couple times, but they put that record together with Rusty Young and Jess, Jesse Dayton, and, and they put it out, and it's getting some airplay, and I just think, yeah, I do. I would just like people to hear this song and record this song because it's kind of an attitude that people could use in the world, you know, so. Jack Temption says that even though he tried to leave rock and roll, it was like the Godfather 3. I try to get out and they suck me back in. Oh, yeah, yeah. But, I mean, just even if I was going to play in bars for the rest of my life, I just, that that's what I want to do. You know, I just, nothing else is uh, is as great for me mm-hmm. but everybody's different you know there's always somebody in your town every little town has people who are incredible performers but they don't have everything it takes to, to to be in the big time but they may have the musical talent and the creativity you know we all have our local heroes who are fantastic and it doesn't mean they're any less good we'll have more of our conversation with the great jack Temption coming up next week Make sure you comment on our videos, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Mm-hmm.